Once upon a time, in a small village nestled among rolling hills, there lived a humble farmer named Hiro. Hiro was known throughout the village for his kind heart and generous nature. He had always believed in the power of selflessness and the interconnectedness of all living beings. One day, an opportunity arose for Hiro to put his beliefs into action. It was a scorching summer day when a group of wandering monks arrived in the village. They had traveled a long way, and their robes were tattered and dusty. The villagers gathered to welcome them, offering food and shelter, but Hiro noticed that the monks appeared weary and parched. Filled with compassion, Hiro rushed to his farm and fetched a jug of cool, refreshing water. Without hesitation, he approached the monks and presented them with the jug, bowing respectfully. The leader of the monks, Master Koji, accepted the water with gratitude. He observed Hiro's act of kindness and saw the sincerity in his eyes. Master Koji smiled warmly and said, Thank you, dear Hiro. Your offering comes from a place of true selflessness. As a token of our appreciation, we would like to offer you a gift. Hiro was taken aback. He had not expected anything in return for his simple act of generosity. Nevertheless, he nodded gratefully, curious about the gift the monks had in mind. The following morning, Master Koji requested Hiro's presence at the village temple. Hiro arrived, still curious and uncertain about the nature of the gift. The other villagers, too, had gathered, intrigued by the unfolding events. With a serene expression, Master Koji addressed the crowd. Hiro has shown us all the power of selflessness and interconnectedness. Today, we shall honor him by planting a special tree, a symbol of unity and compassion. The villagers gasped in awe as they watched the monks carefully plant a sapling in the center of the temple courtyard. Its branches spread wide, providing shade and shelter for all who sought refuge. The leaves shimmered with a vibrant green, and its roots reached deep into the earth, connecting with the very essence of the village. As the years passed, the tree grew tall and strong, just like the spirit of selflessness within Hiro and the villagers. People from far and wide would visit the village to witness the magnificent tree that stood as a testament to the power of a simple act of kindness. Hiro continued to live his life with an open heart, inspiring others to follow his example. The tree became a reminder for all who saw it, encouraging them to embrace selflessness and recognize the interconnectedness of every living being. And so, the village thrived, not just in material wealth but in a profound sense of community and compassion. All because of one person's act of kindness, which blossomed into something far greater than anyone could have imagined. Remember, dear friends, that the smallest acts of selflessness can have the most significant impact on the world around us. By offering our kindness without expecting anything in return, we can create a web of interconnectedness that spreads far and wide, making the world a better place for all.